know how people will react to it, but what do you think you want to convey in some way? You say you, people don't want to live this life, I understand, but you want to convey some, some kind of sense of what this extremely complex life was about. I never understand the concept. How do I, ex how do I express this? I've, I've never expressed this, but how do I start? Uh, I've never, um, I've never, um, I was never able um, to understand the concept of greatness. I just never was able to understand that concept of greatness. And um, as time went on and I've gotten older and I've, um, I've met many journeys on people that I met on my journey and people who I've read about on my journey, I read that um, all greatness, the majority of greatness in itself doesn't come with goodness. The two don't coexist with one another. And um, I spent all my life trying to become great because I had such a low self-esteem. And, um, and I realized um, late in life, well, I'm saying I'm 47, but late in my life, that um, all great men are not good men. And then so I try to embark on a whole different career and try to become good. But what's the concept of good? Being a, a, um, a floor mat, I never understood the concept of good. If the concept of good is pretty much then I must be a politician because politicians are always striking for goodness and always trying to win votes from people. And the only, way, only reason that we win votes because they believe that we're good. So how do we live in those two dimensions at once? You want that greatness for self-gratification, but you want goodness from a human perspective. And I, and I, I really have no idea, no clue how do, I, um, how do I juggle both of them and be in harmony. And then in all actuality, they don't exist. You have to pick a side. What are the qualities you admire in people? Um, Yes, um, desire. Um, I'm, I, I respect a person who's willing to die for what he truly wants, even if it's love, even if it's a, a woman, whatever it is that he truly believes in, and that he believes that he, he um, it transcends him to that um, that level to um, demand um, for love. For instance, for instance um, I look at love as a, a command to just rise to your greatest potential. You know, and um, that's how people should feel. Their objective should be to rise to their best potential in life. If it's to lose 30 pounds, if it's to pass a test, it should be um, to win a fight, to be, um, to be admired by people all over the world. It should allow you to rise to your greatest potential, that you look at yourself in the most grandest fashion. I'd like to take um, a moment here to, to say that this book is, is 